Have you ever pondered about the essence of hospitality in the Christian faith? At the heart of this question lies the biblical book of 3 John, a letter penned by John the Apostle. John's primary aim in writing this epistle was to address the Christian community, specifically a beloved member named Gaius. Through his letter, John commends Gaius for his unwavering practice of hospitality towards fellow believers and even strangers. The book presents a stark contrast in the form of Diotrephes, a man who not only rejected John's authority but also refused to extend hospitality to others. Diotrephes symbolizes the dangers of pride and ego in a community where generosity and open-heartedness should reign supreme. John's admiration for Gaius's conduct and his criticism of Diotrephes's actions weave together a powerful narrative about the importance of hospitality in the Christian faith. In the eyes of John, Gaius embodies the Christian virtue of generosity while Diotrephes represents the perils of pride and selfishness. So, what can we glean from this brief yet profound letter? As we delve into the heart of 3 John, several key lessons emerge. First and foremost, we see the emphasis placed on hospitality and generosity, two cornerstones of the Christian faith. John commends Gaius for his kindness towards strangers, reminding us that acts of love and kindness should not be confined to those within our immediate circles. Next, we see the necessity for humility in leadership. John reproves Diotrephes, who has let pride cloud his judgment. This serves as a stark reminder of the dangers of pride and rejection of authority. When we elevate ourselves above others, we risk losing sight of the essence of our faith, love and humility. Finally, we're encouraged to emulate Demetrius, who is praised for his good reputation and adherence to the truth. 3 John, although short, is rich in wisdom, serving as a guide on how to live a Christian life of love, humility, and generosity. How then does 3 John resonate with us today? As we reflect on 3 John, its relevance in our contemporary world becomes apparent. This brief yet profound letter serves as a guiding light, illuminating the path for modern Christians. It underscores the importance of hospitality, a virtue that, in today's fast-paced world, is often overlooked. It reminds us to open our hearts and homes, to welcome others with warmth and kindness, just as John commended Gaius for his hospitality. Furthermore, 3 John highlights the virtue of humility. In a world where self-promotion often takes precedence, this letter encourages us to remain humble, to acknowledge that we are part of a greater whole. It teaches us to put others before ourselves, to serve rather than be served. In conclusion, 3 John is a timeless reminder of the essence of Christian virtues, a guide that helps us navigate our journey of faith with love, humility, and generosity.